Hello friends, in today's video, I'm going to share about my experience of buying a fruiting plant through Sukata Nursery, which is located in West Bengal. Well, I tried finding the same variety through other uh, online portal because locally it is not available and there was a quite uh, huge price difference. So I thought let's try out and see how they box, how they send. So I'm going to share all my experience and before that, let me welcome you to my channel. And if you have not subscribed my channel so far, request you to kindly subscribe. Your motivation is highly important for me. Well, here back to the video. Now you can see there's the varieties of plants they have. The maximum are fruiting plants and based on the you know category, based on the sizes, the price is varying. They have, uh, you know, uh, some unique varieties also. And there's a price is a little higher, but generally a Kesar mango and a Langra mango, which is the two which I was looking uh, uh, to buy, is available at uh, genuinely a good price. So I purchased nine of it and uh, three of uh, Langra mango, one uh, golden variety of custard apple and two of Thai green apple. So this is the purchase which I did. And with the courier charges, it all worked out around 4,500 to me. The support level was very good and that's what I can feel. First is that uh, when the plant arrived uh, after sixth day uh, you know, of payment, uh, you can see the first look, I'm just unboxing it. It looks quite healthy. and uh, But the advice what uh, the seller has given to me is allow the plant to settle down for two to three weeks. And that's what I did it. So along with the uh, you know plant they have also sent the bamboo stick which is uh, work as a support and a small packet of fungicide for the spray so i did that fungicide spray as well as neem oil spray just to ensure that the uh, the plant remains healthy uh, from any attack or fungal infection and uh, but the one thing which i noticed is that one of the uh, plant uh, the green uh, thai green apple plant have been broken while transportation which i reported back and he acknowledged it he said Ki, sir uh, nothing to worry whatever plant survive uh, it's good if not survive i'm going to replace that so allow for two to three weeks of time you will able to see and exactly i i did that and i'm very thankful for him second thing he asked me to remove this uh, polythene bag which was tightening the uh, soil the white one and allowed me to put some you know advised me to put some more soil because he has reduced the soil uh, to minimize the weightage because a quite uh, good number of plants was there and it is was on extreme side so that's another thing i did and uh, three weeks i allowed the plant to be there in semi shade area well some of the plant was on the shock could be because of transportation could be because of the you know change of place and uh, that this gestational period of three weeks has helped uh, uh, this plant either to recope or survive or few of it at least can so that you know we need to extend some more care but the ultimate uh, backdrop was that he said if any plant don't survive or didn't survive he is going to replace that so only the courier charge we have to pay which is a very very you know helping or encouraging support i can see from any seller so what i did is that i allowed this plants to be there three weeks meantime i created a, a soil uh, the trench uh, for uh, plantation uh, even though my farm was not ready uh, because of the rain a lot of bushes was around so got the area clean created a trench uh, created some organic base so that you know uh, when we do the uh, potting of this healthy plant the plant grow further well so in description you can find all the details and this is how uh, the farm was looking even i did some plantation prior to rain uh, mango almost 30 variety uh, plants we did uh, prior to rain and you know almost 28 have survived two have uh, didn't survive uh, die back happened i'm going to show you in another video but the good part is that uh, all these 28 plants have been surviving well. Uh, I can see some growth also after, you know, help of developer we can see this area. This is how it cleaned. So it was helped me to identify the location because the gapping between two plants is very important because ultimately uh, the kind of nutrients or the sunlight or the growth, you need a good spacing, at least 8 to 10 feet uh, between the, you know, or among the plants. So that's something which is uh, important. So only when the place was clear, I can able to see that. And this is the uh, plantation I did, a Kesar mango like that. Almost 10 plant, I, uh, you know, uh, yeah, nine plant I did almost uh, plantation I did. Balance, I left it as it is in my parking area in a semi shade area. And I'm going to show you the result, what exactly happened with those plant also and what's the level of support I'm getting from them. So this is, is the outcome after third week. Uh, you can see about all those healthy plants. I did the plantation. Meantime, 
whenever I used to visit there, I tried applying uh, the fungicide and the neem, neem oil spray because as you can see, you have seen that a lot of bushes was around. So chances of, you know, getting some attack. And this is the status. This is a very recent uh, update. And one of the Kesar mango plant, you can see uh, the, the leaves are completely dried. And this is why, it, you know, he told me to uh, leave the plant for three weeks. And exactly it helped me to, uh, you know, know which plant can survive further, which need to replace. But the one of the, you know, Thai green apple berries, you can see the new shoots have come, new leaves have come. This is another Kesar mango where all the leaves were dried fallen down the, the new leaves have started coming here also the new shoots have come so by seeing all this thing i can say that uh, the root ball was very healthy the base what they grown the you know plant is very healthy because of that uh, within three weeks of time of, uh, after shock these plants are you know uh, revoking or uh, you know uh, kind of recouping which is very good it shows the plant uh, base is very good yeah golden variety of uh, you know custard apple is not uh, re revoked so far so i'm going to send the separate video to him and he's going to replace me the plants so i hope i have provided all the information to you thanks for watching this video if you liked it give a thumbs up thank you